Hey guys, sorry if the camera's slow, but today's video is, is it worth it to get a Wii U in 2020? Let's see. This video is based on my opinions. Don't mind if the camera's slow. I'm shooting this before my camera was charged, so it should be, get better. So if the quality is low, because like last subject, and remember, this video is for my opinions. It's okay if you don't agree, but remember, this is my opinions. And I'll see you once my camera is charged. Don't worry, I'll cut that part off. See you in a second. Okay, guys. So I'm just gonna show you this video of parts for the phone charge. Wait. No. Okay, so is it worth it? I'm gonna get the switch part. So this, yes, the switch is new and all. If you say seven, 2017 is new, but the switch is also, you know, not very, very backwards compatible. Like you can download all SNES games and NES games, but all. Oh, this is NES games and SNES games. That's not really much. No, well, this video is not going to be very long, and it might just unexpectedly cut off. But then, if that happens, I'll get the video ready. And if it so, if it just randomly stops and the video ends, it's okay because there'd be a part two coming out. So, is it? Is it? Yes, it is the newest console, and it's really good. It has Mario Odyssey and all those other good games. But the Wii U is, is just... Is old than the collector's item, but the Switch... Is... One minute. But I mean... Okay, back. Okay, so what I mean is, like, the Switch can send messages like the Wii U used to be able to do. And, like, the Wii U can still friend, and... And like my my thoughts on Splatoon 2, it's a sequel game. Come on, the original is way better, but full ratings. Mario Maker 2 is good and all. It added the 3D world game style, but there's just something about the Switch. It's not spe special, but we'll come back to the Switch later, maybe. And yes, you can dog it, but that's it. And like, why isn't there more controllers? Like. I already have the Joy-Cons and the Pro Controller, but if for the Wii, there's a Classic Controller, Classic Controller Pro. And, like, it's, like, you could play Wii games on the Wii U, but the Switch is just not backwards compatible. Like, come on. Okay, now let's talk about the Wii U. I mean, the Wii U is really good. Because, like, it's backwards compatible with... All like almost all the games, like already, it can you play DS games? But then it has cool, good games like Mario 3D World and all the cool games like Nintendo Land. Well, that game came with it, but eh. and the 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 Wii U still has some online services that are available, like take like take. Well, you know. These, these two, they're still available. And then, let's turn to the other screen and see some of the other games. Like, Mario City World's really good. And, I just love it. It, it, it and, the Wii wouldn't be, the, the Switch wouldn't be around if, if the Wii U hadn't released. And this game is also really cool. And it's just sad that it's only like twenty dollars. I mean, this game is short. Where is? And there's no, and you can play without the gamepad, but you're forced to be that player. And player one will always be the gamepad if you're on two player. Yeah, that's that's nice. And you have to, you're forced to play play with the gamepad on most things. On maybe all, pro moves, all of them. And then the cool thing is it had 
there's two things you can look at the TV screen and the and the Wii U screen gamepad screen yes you have to be really close to the the console to use the gamepad it just sucks but come on it's the Wii U they couldn't just make the gamepad good enough it wasn't as good and then and then also the pro controller like come on like i know this isn't made by nintendo but like the switch doesn't have any pro controllers like this like, come on it's, it's a big step up from the wii it just wasn't as memorable and then back to to this and the eShop still works for example the internet browser still works friends this might even still work and you know you can like why did the is the 3ds wolf and stuff because so this is just i'm actually gonna do some and i might get some like ga gaming working on this channel but put that aside it just overall a really good console back to the switch nope 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 don't, don't, don't. And one of the cool things about the Wii U is you can just um, play a bunch of games. Like, like, you can play a bunch of old Another good thing about the Wii U is it can do this. You can play virtual console games from the N64 and other console great consoles. Like, can the Switch do that? The Switch can only play like Super Nintendo games and NES games. That's it. And you can just straight up buy these. You don't need to have a membership to to play. No, you do, you can just straight up buy them on the Wii U. Sure, you do need an like a ID, but that's free. Come on. And then look at all the other things you do. Go down. And like look up. You can play your favorite Wii game games above. Like the Wii games, you can play Nintendo DS games. Heck, you can play Nintendo games just now, and you could even play Game Boy Advance, Super NES, just like the Switch, Nintendo Entertainment System games. Of course, you you need a Switch to play also Battle Royale games like Fortnite and well other games that have online multiplayer. But like Nintendo didn't abandon the console all yet, like. Splatoon, like Splatoon, like for example, you can still play Splatoon on online, like cool, and, and like so, like the Switch has all of its stuff online available, but 